What do you see? Look carefully. Look closer. Now do you see? A simple chicken feather. On the surface, not very exciting. Worthless. Or is it? What if I told you that a chicken feather could help you at work? Help you at play? Protect your family? Even help clean up the environment and reduce your reliance on petroleum? All this from a feather? Impossible. Is it? Let's look closer. At Eastern Bioplastics, we look beyond the obvious and see the potential in our products, our clients, and our future. Who would have ever thought that such a simple feather could be blended into plastic? This is not just an idea, but it's happening right here in the heart of the Shenandoah Valley. Since 2008, Eastern Bioplastics has been manufacturing bioplastic resin composites. These are no ordinary bioplastics, but blends of poultry feathers and conventional polyphens like polypropylene and polyethylene. Why feathers? Simple, because bioplastics made in part with feathers are less reliant on petroleum by up to 40%, helping save an estimated 8,500 barrels of crude oil every year. How much is that? That's the same amount of CO2 emissions as burning 409,392 gallons of gasoline providing electricity to power 455 homes every year, and equivalent to the greenhouse gases put off by 761 passenger vehicles. And unlike other bioplastics that often rely on raw materials from out of our population's food supply, our bioplastics tap into a renewable resource that has never been utilized to this capacity before. Currently, 3 billion pounds of feathers are either going to waste or being thrown into a landfill annually. Instead, these feathers could be contributing to our economy and helping to reduce our dependence on oil. By going with Eastern Bioplastics Emerald Resins, you will be diverting these feathers into useful industrial productions, while at the same time creating a more sustainable environment for future generations. We begin with the feathers. Raw feathers are brought into the plant and washed, sorted, dried, and ground into a usable form. We then blend the fiber materials with polymers like polypropylene, polyethylene, through an extrusion process that melts, blends, bonds, and generates bioresin composite pellets. These pellets contain up to 40% feather biomass and can be dropped into your extruder, injection molder, or compression molder. While these resins will never be clear, they can be colored either during compounding or injection molding. Maybe you're thinking, this all sounds great, but can Eastern Bioplastics deliver what I need for my business? Good question. Let's look at how bioplastics made with feathers compared with other plastics. It does not take green to be green. You will find that our bioplastics are competitively priced with other conventional polyolefin plastics and manufactured here in the United States. Our bioplastics work with existing plastics machinery. You do not need to invest in new equipment, but can continue to make your parts with the assurance that you are reducing your carbon footprint by up to 40%. Our bioplastics have decreased density make them lighter than other mineral filled resins. They are also more flexible than conventional polyolefins. Lighter, more flexible, and just as strong. Our bioplastics have been used for a wide range of industrial purposes. If you have an idea for an application, talk to us. We will do our best to engineer a bioplastic resin that fits your product's needs. Here is how we can help integrate emerald resins into your product line. Help design applications. Assist with injection molding needs. Evaluate physical and mechanical properties of emerald resins. We have the capabilities to help you bring your products to market as quickly as possible. This is who we are. This is what we do. But what about you? Look carefully. Look closer at your own company and ask yourself, do we want to save petroleum? Do we want to help the environment? If it costs the same, works the same, why not? That's what we see. How about you?